Hi, everybody, and thanks for joining us. Tim Kitzer here along with Brian Haley. And it's a gorgeous day for football. Today's game, the Jacksonville Jaguars take on the Atlanta Falcons. I'll tell you, I've never seen this stadium this full, Tim. This is a matchup that has been highly anticipated. Listen to this crowd. They're ready for some football. First down. Firing! Uh, that's going to be an incomplete. Second down. Throws it up. First down. Now fired. Touchdown, Atlanta! You got a receiver who goes after a ball like a bird dog, and good things will happen. And with that, the score is 7-0. to zero. They'll make that tackle right around the 38-yard line. So, first down. Unleashes it. And that'll be a first down. Tim, if you got a quarterback that can make big passes like that, it just spreads out that defense and keeps them thin and on their heels. Great play. Five-yard pickup. Second and goal here. Tim, this is the perfect time to try and draw that defense off sides. Out of bounds he goes. And he stopped short for a five-yard loss. So it's third and goal. You know they'd like to punch it in and not have to settle for a three here. So out comes the kicker here on fourth down. Wow, what a kick. Tim, that little fella's going to be glowing like Tinkerbell all night. And with that, the score is 7-3. to three. Out of bounds, and he brings it all the way back to the 34. Now Seth. Has a man downfield. First down. First and goal. Time to get out those entrenchment tools. Gains 18 on the play. And the defense digs in here. It's second and goal. This just in. Touchdown. That the score is 14 to 3. They'll make the tackle around the 23. Now set. Pick up six yards. It'll be second down. Unleashes. Hello. Goodbye. And that'll bring up third down. Finds his man. After one quarter, the score is 14 to 3.
and goal in the red zone, Tim. This is a good one. Firing. In like a bridge. And with that, the score is 14 to 10. They'll make that tackle around the 31 yard line. First down. Let's this one rip. Nice gain of 27 yards on the play. Short yardage situation here. Firing. Hit the bricks and move the sticks. That was a big first down there. First and goal. Pick up a 13 on the play. Here they come. Second and goal. Now let's see how they line up. Make some noise for the boys. The score is 21 to 10. They'll make the tackle right around the 21. And first down coming up. And that ball is intercepted. And the offensive train gets derailed with that pick. Ah, I missed that one. I was updating my status on Facebook. Check it out. Still not ready for Monday. Yuck. Picks up 15 yards. The offense now ready. Watch out for the blitz. And with that, the score is 28 to 10. They'll make that tackle right around the 30. First down, let's see if they can get something going here. Turf, it's what's for dinner. It's a gain of 21. Second down, they line up over the ball. Eight yard gain. They line up over the ball for a tough short yard situation. Get her done. First down. First and goal. It's crunch time now. He unloads. They pick up a chunk of about 15 yards on that play. Second and goal situation here. The backfield now set. With the grab and the end zone, touchdown! And with that, the score is 28 to 17. They'll make the tackle right around the 19-yard line. They'll line up over the ball. He's got a man! And he's wrestled to the ground. Well, you can't afford to blow a short yardage situation like this, Brian. Let's it rip. I'll take that. 
And at the half, the score is 28 to 17. Tim, I'll tell you, you can feel the energy in this stadium. Or it might just be that triple chocolate mocha espresso I had. The offense now set. Nicely done. A 14-yard gain. And that'll bring up second down. Finds his man. Well, that ball there should have gone into his hands. Instead, it went to the ground. Now, I believe that's an incomplete pass, Tim. A 15-yard loss. That hurts. Lined up for the punt. You know the way this defense is playing. I'd punt, too. Boy, this guy's got great speed, but he didn't have a chance to even get the engine started there. Wouldn't have start. Pass on the way. Now that's the way to move the ball. First down. First and goal in the red zone, Tim. This is where you got to make it happen. And he was going backwards in a hurry with a loss of about 12 on that play. This defense is fired up, and so am I. Intercepted! So the defense comes up with the big play. We've seen this movie before. Following the interception, it's first down. Oh, and he comes up with it! A 29-yard pickup on the play. A big short yardage situation here, Brian. That was way too easy, Tim. Somebody needs to get after that quarterback and instill the fear of God in him. First down. He lets it rip. It's a gain of 17 on the play. And here we go, second down. Throws a strike. Move the sticks and add on six. This is an old-fashioned pitcher's duel tonight. I didn't expect such a close game. First down. Finds his man! First down. Let's it rip. Call that a gain of 29. They need a nice push from the offensive line here to pick up that first down. And that's about a four yard loss. Boy, he took a hit that last time. Is he gonna be ready to go here? Incomplete. You can lead a horse to water, Tim, but if he ain't thirsty enough, you gotta kick him in the rear.
time you get a kick return, there's a glimmer of hope that the entire game will turn around. Let's see what this one brings. That's the end of three. So, first down. Whoa, nice catch! A pickup of about 16. Second down. He unloads. Touchdown, Jaguars! Those are the kind of big plays that can sink any defense in a hurry. Well, these guys better start bailing, because that was a direct hit. take the upper hand in this game, Brian. Yeah, they seem very evenly matched thus far. You wouldn't say thus. I wouldn't, but uh, you wrote it for me, so that's how I said it, Tim. Fumbaroni! Coming up with a fumble is like hitting a lucky leprechaun scratch-off lotto. I got beat up by a leprechaun at a St. Paddy's Day parade once. That little fella had fists like a mule hook. Well, they decide to go for it. Now I can see why they've got the kicker in a headlock over there. He can't get on the field. They're just giving him a noogie or something. Here we go. Anything can happen here on a kickoff return. Let's see what this one brings up. Now set. Goes long. Nothing doing there. The offense gets set. Second down. Here's the pass. A 17-yard gain. The defense calling out signals. He's got a man. First down. First and goal. This is a great place to be. You can pretty much run any play you want from here. But I would advise against the fake punt. As the defense realigns itself, it's second and goal. Moving the ball nicely there. Good blocking up front. They're exploiting those mismatches nicely. Now on the run. And into the end zone for a touchdown. And with that, they grab the lead. Okay, two-point conversion. If this turns into a barn burner, that might make the difference. They hatch with that call. And as it turns out, the fox got in the hen house first and ate them all. Now set. And he's going to run with it. And he goes down hard. Nice tackle. Second down. And the ball is knocked loose. And this contest is over. The Atlanta Falcons win the game. And that should do it for us here in the booth. I'm Tim Kitzer along with Brian Haley saying see you next time.